are, baby. How you doing? You seem to be struggling, just like how I left you. You mind telling me what the problem is? Oh, right. I forgot. I taped your mouth. Let me get that for you. Hey, whoa. We don't have to use vulgar language. You could talk to me like a normal person, just like how I'm talking to you, okay? You said that, but what I'm hearing is you want to cuddle. So come here, baby. Hey, stop struggling, okay? You're kind of tied to the bed, meaning you're not going anywhere. So you're going to have to enjoy this. If not, I'll break a bone. So how did you sleep? You had a nightmare. Was I in it? I was? Oh, joy. <laughs> did I make you scared? Was I, let's see, the main villain of this nightmare? You wanted to kill me. Oh, we all know that's not going to happen. You love me, don't you? You told me you loved me. When we started dating, you don't love me anymore? And here I thought we would be together forever. I thought you'd be the one to be my forever. No, I wouldn't say I'm delusional. I just say things have changed and you told me that you'd love me no matter how I am. Because you loved me for me. And this is me. So if you say now that you don't love me, then you were lying the whole time. I think I have to break another finger. Hmm? Is that what you want? No. Then tell me you love me. Tell me you don't want me to go anywhere. Tell me you want me here right by your side. Good girl. Do you want to watch anything? I got the, um, the package on cable that has every single channel. I have Netflix, Hulu, Disney Plus, anything you could think about, I have. I got it all just for you so you can enjoy your time here. You don't have to go anywhere anymore. I'll take care of it. You want food? I'll go get it. You need clothes? Don't worry, I'm already on it. You want to leave the house? There's a timer on that. I'm sorry. You have 30 minutes out and in. And if you aren't back, I will have to hunt you down. And you do not want that. Because if I do find you, best believe... I will be putting my hands on you. Anyways, what did you want to watch? You wanted to watch a new anime. Which one was that? Hunter Hunter? Isn't that an old one? Oh, they had a remake. Hmm, maybe I'll watch it with you. Is there anything you wanted to eat? Anything you want me to order? Anything you want me to cook? I'll do anything for you, baby. Spaghetti? That's pretty specific. I thought you were gonna say, like, McDonald's or something. I know how you like fast food. You want me to make a spaghetti? You want meatballs as well, or just the noodles? Spaghetti, that's it. Okay, I'll be back. I'm back. Here is your... Oh, that's why you wanted me to make spaghetti. Because it was going to take a long time. I'll be taking that knife away from you. 
And because of that, you're going to have to receive some punishment. What do you mean for what? This was an attempt at escape. The three rules that come with dating me, and the ones that you have to abide by, are no lying, no talking back, and no trying to escape. And unfortunately for you, you kind of broke all three. So, I'm gonna have to punish you. Give me your thumb. Why? Because I'm gonna break it. Why else? Or, you can beg me not to break it, and maybe I'll reconsider. More. I wanna hear you. Louder. Say my name. One more time. Good girl. Oh, baby, don't cry. It ruins your face. That beautiful face of yours. The face that everybody wants a piece of. The one that belongs to me. Now, since you understand the consequences, I think we could get past it. You've learned, right? I trust I won't have to make this decision again, no? Now, like you asked for, I made spaghetti. And you're going to eat it. And if you don't, I think we're going to have to revisit this conversation. Yes? Good. Enjoy. Did you enjoy your food? I cooked it with ingredients that I knew you'd like, so there's no way you can tell me you didn't like it. You did like it? Oh, amazing. I'm gonna go clean your plate now, okay? I'm back. Are you feeling tired yet? No, I didn't put anything in your food. I'm just saying, because it's midnight, and I would assume that you'd want to go to sleep. Don't look at me like that. I just fed you. Be more grateful. Anyways, I'm actually kind of tired too. So, I'll join you in bed. You have no choice but to be the small spoon. And I get to shower you with all the affection I have pent up towards you. I love you. Say it back. <clears throat> You're so sweet. Good night, baby. I'll see you in the morning. <laughs>